Hey guys, welcome to my channel. I come to do the um, reading for Taurus. This is for my Tauruses. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, Mars, Jupiter. The spirit, give me what I need for my Taurus. Drop. my tribe the messages I need I hope everyone is doing well okay let's see all right you got the queen of cups at the bottom of the deck cancer Pisces Scorpio okay somebody who wants to give some love they're ready to express their love but it look like they're gonna be yeah see we're gonna see uh -uh, I'm not gonna start this Spirit, give me what I need for my Taurus tribe. Seven of Cups. Seven of Cups. You got the Sun. Leo. You got the Fool. It's about to really take a risk. Hmm. What else, Spirit? Four of Pentacles. The Empress. Taurus. Libra. You have the wheel. Wow. See all these major arcanas? What is going on with my Taurus tribe? Good Lord, you got the lovers. Whoa. Okay. So let's see what's going on. It looks like somebody's ready to start a new beginning. Okay, they win their options. This person got a lot of options. This person had always have options. Okay. I don't know. Look like they've been. That's why the lovers is here. They got to make up their mind what they want to do. Okay. You got the seven of cups. They got a lot of options. But apparently you are part of this option. So that's why the lovers card is here. Okay. That's a divine love. You got to make a decision. Okay. I don't know if they hope they no. They probably, they probably were holding back. And now they done made up their mind. They want to take this risk, but we're going to see. Okay. At the bottom of the, of the deck, you got the four of wands. Okay. Aries, Leo, Sag, Sagittarius, Gemini, Leo, Taurus, Libra, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Let's see. All right. So, all right. Let me get some more. Let's get some more messages. Look like the wheel has come in. Look, but it also looks like the wheel is going in your favor in reference to maybe some money as well um and a new beginning and darling and, and, and honey you're gonna be walking in your power because they go to empress it's giving me the vibe that you're 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 deciding to take a leap of faith on you and you do have a lot of options okay all right but spirit and spirit probably telling them I'm, I'm just getting different messages now spirit might want you might be telling you to hold back don't tell people your business be quiet Shh. Okay, because you got some, you got a, you got a, uh, you got some options that you, you, you need to make a decision. That's why the lovers card is here. So take this as a, as a, uh, they just want you to pay attention. Okay, pay attention. All right, here we go. What else, spirit? This is, this is nice. Okay. I, I see money. I see money. You got the devil. 
This is um you got the King of Wands. Is it some addictions? Is it some attachments that you need to I don't know. Let's see. You got the Queen of Cups. You got the chariot and the ace of swords. So what I'm getting from this is um, someone has been holding on to you. Okay. Someone has, has energetically been holding on to you. And this person... This person... This person is, is, is a passionate person. This is Avery Leo Sage, King of Wands. This person is passionate. Not only is this person passionate, this person has a lot of love for you. Okay? I don't know who this person is, but it seems like this person been quiet about it. Okay? You got the four of wands right here. Let me put this right here. Okay? So whoever this person is, they just... I don't, I see them charging in. I see them coming in, but they got to make up their mind first because they're ready to express some love to you, some genuine love. It, it's giving me the vibe that y'all not, y'all didn't really have a, y'all, y'all didn't have a relationship like that. Y'all was pretty much, what you call it, friends with, I don't know. I don't know if that's the right word. Y'all was like good friends. Okay, and y'all did a lot together on top of the friends with benefits part. You got the eight of wands. Somebody want this, somebody want to see you. Okay, this is somebody that's attached to you. Like I said, energetically. Okay, all right. You have in the clarity of this whole reading is this person got a lot of feelings for you. Okay, this person. This is not. This is not someone that you know. Oh, well, you. I'm sorry. You do know them. If this is not someone that you was in a relationship because it's not giving me a relationship vibe of y'all broke up and it was a big old mess. Mm -mm, I'm not getting that. I'm getting that this person, yeah, this person is somebody who been who's guarding himself. See that you can see he's standing behind that wand, looking. Okay. He hiding behind that wand. He the wounded warrior. Okay, something is going on. Something he's been fighting something. He, she, whoever been fighting something. Okay. You got the Ten of Pentacles. Maybe they've been trying, you know, this wounded warrior is ready to come in with the Ten, ten of Pentacles, but it's I, wait a minute. The magician. Mm-hmm. You got the magician, the wheel, and the ten of pentacles. Okay. This person is manifesting. And you got the star. Aquarius. Sagittarius. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Cancer. So, this person, listen, y'all. This person has a lot of love for you. Okay. This person want a family with you. I'm being real. This person want a family with you. And here go the queen of wands at the bottom of the deck. Okay. There y'all go. Both of y'all passionate. Both of y'all love each other. Y'all had some good times together. Okay. The normal, the, the normal good time, have fun with your friend type setting. But friends with benefits. Mm-hmm. What else, spirit? You got the Hierophant. Taurus energy. Okay. Direct connection with spirit. Not only that, this might be this person wanting to come in and marry you. Okay. You got the Six of Pentacles. This is reciprocity. This person want reciprocity with you. Okay. Mm-hmm. This is this is this is this is some good energy right here. Okay. So whoever this person is, they've been hiding their love for you. Yeah, they've been hiding. But now they mm -mm, they're getting ready to come in and give you and let you know they're ready to uh they want to take this to a higher level of commitment. Okay, you got the lovers, you got the four of wands, you got the king and the queen of wands. 
Both of y'all to be passionate about each other. You got the Empress. The Wheel of Fortune, the Ten of Pentacles. See, you got a lot of cards that's letting, that's giving me the vibe that this is go, this would be a great relationship. Mm hmm. One of y'all, if not both, done been through a lot. Okay, and this is what's been holding this up. But it seemed like with these major arcanas, it seemed like spirit is somebody been manifesting. Okay. And spirit is bringing this good news in. This is good news. This is this is really beautiful. Okay, I, I, I'm I'm really happy about this one. This is nobody coming. It just ain't this this somebody this this is somebody coming back from the past, but it's not a horrible story to come along with it. Okay, I'm not I'm not picking that up. I'm picking up that this is just some good energy. Okay, you got the king and the queen of wands. You got the ace. Of swords. This is the truth and clarity of this reading. This is beautiful. Okay. This person ready to take this leap and bring some messages in. This is, I, I can't see anything wrong. I could see this person probably been through a lot and was holding back. And probably, you know, when you're going through a lot, you think the worst of all situations and probably was in this illusion. Okay. This person was in an illusion for a minute. But they don't come up out of that. And they get they got direct contact with spirit. They've been hoping and wishing and manifesting. I don't see no... I, I, I don't see any... Bad vibes here. You know? I don't. And congratulations to whoever this is. This is beautiful. Okay? Let's see. We got one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight nine you got nine major arcanas okay and so what is that gemini taurus libra taurus aquarius sagittarius scorpio cancer gemini libra aquarius cancer pisces scorpio this is beautiful okay somebody this person is ready to express some love it's a lot of love here it's a lot of love. This person wants stability now. Okay, maybe this person just probably had a little bit of growing up to go through, but this person is ready. Congratulations. This is really, really nice. Okay. That was some good, that's some good energy right there. Like I like that. So um this person has been again has been holding on to you energetically. Okay. And now they're getting ready to make themselves known to take the sleep of faith. Mm -hmm. They want a family with you. Okay. All right, you and this person probably been through a little something, but at the end of the day, y'all love each other. Okay, all right. So, Taurus, this is y'all. That was pretty good. Let me um get some romance angels. Let me see if I can get a couple more. Let's see, Spirit, give me what I need. Yeah, that was pretty good. Y'all, y'all, you you got a winner here. So, and it's probably you know it seems like it's giving me the vibe that you and this person been waiting on each other. You and this person been probably looking it everywhere, but right, right there. It, it, they say usually it's always somebody that's right in front of you, but you don't see them. You see everybody else, and when you recognize it's that person, <laughs> you're like, "What? What in the world was I waiting on?" Mm-hmm. Yeah. What's this? Okay. okay, give your relationship a chance. Work on your partnership and chemistry. There's a strong magnetic attraction here. Okay, so what this what is what spirit is trying to tell you is that this person, this you and this person, y'all are very attracted to each other. Y'all are very, very, very. Y'all chemistry is pretty much the same. You you did have the king and the queen of wands, remember? Okay. That's a lot of passion. That's a lot of chemistry. Okay. Give your relationship a chance. Work on your partnership. So now that you know who it is, you know this is your partner, you got to go ahead and start expressing your love. And this person is ready. Yep, this person is ready. Look, you got passion at the bottom of the deck. Passion. Okay. All right, Tars. And have heart to heart conversations. Okay. 
honestly discuss your feelings with each other, okay? This is going to be a beautiful relationship. I'm so happy for y'all. I'm talking about y'all. Look, it might you just never know, okay? I'm happy. I'm happy for us. How about that? Give me a few more spirit. Keep an open mind. Your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectation. See, that's probably what was going on. You you thought that this person wasn't your 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 type. And you had different expectations on what you thought that you wanted. But baby, life will mature you and let you see that some of that stuff did not matter. And that person that was in front of you was it the whole entire time. All right, Taurus. This is y'all reading, um, our reading. And I hope it resonates and I'll talk to you guys soon. I love you. Bye.